Welcome back to Hightail Spins. How's it going? I hope you're having a great day. In today's video, we're going to be talking about sad news about things we will not see in Hightail. But before we begin with today's topic, make sure to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and turn on the notifications so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. Without further ado, let's get right into the video. Fast Release we are very afraid that this game is going to take its time, and it will be a long time before we can play it. We heard all of the hearsays and stuff like this, and we have hope that they are going to be fake. But even though we can hope that this won't happen, we can never be sure. So what can we do? Well, our only option is to simply wait. We'll inform you just as something changes. We all know the feeling that comes from appreciating something new. It means exploring a new game and finding everything there is to discover. We know that Hytale will be one of those games, and we're very aware of the hype that might be crazy and we're hoping it won't diminish for a moment. But all good must come to an end, we know it will be the same with Hytale. The game that we once loved and cherished will become boring like others. We realize this is probably the pessimistic way of thinking of this, but we can't help it. We know it's inevitable, and we want you to manage your expectations, so you're not as disappointed as you could be. It's painful, but also unavoidable for Hytale. We've hoped that we've helped you understand that and that you won't be filled with rage. Someone had to say it after all. Technoblade On June 30th, Minecraft streamer and YouTuber Alex, aka Technoblade, passed away from cancer at the age of only 23. Tributes have poured in, including developer Mojang itself, which has also added a more subtle but sweet memorial to the streamer in Minecraft itself. After a year-long struggle with cancer drew an outpouring of tributes from fellow streamers and Minecraft content creators, Technoblade passed away. Shortly thereafter, Minecraft studio Mojang also paid its respect to the streamer by making a subtle but important change to the Minecraft Java Edition loading screen. Technoblade was probably the biggest fan of Hytale and was looking very much forward to this game. We wanted him to see it and play it with him or at least watch him play it alone. It would be a great experience for both us and him. Yet now we will never get to see this, and we are completely heartbroken. We hope that Hytale will at least be an amazing game like he wanted it to be. Good Community This is due to various factors. But the in-game experience for Hytale takes the worst parts of other toxic communities such as Roblox and Fortnite. The real catch is the lack of voice communications in Hytale, as we know for now. Text chat may have word filters, but this only produces the same kind of constrained rage. Toxic players are as creative as they are obnoxious, and the game hasn't even been released yet. We are very afraid to see how this community will develop once the game does get released. We can only hope that they will tone it down a bit so that the game will be much more enjoyable. But why is that? We believe this has something to do with Minecraft players who are transferring now to this community. Many of them have always been toxic and they are bringing that toxicity with them over to the Hytale community. This could be because of Dream and other Minecraft YouTubers as well, who are scared that they will lose their popularity once the game is released. So they are now turning their backs on Hytale. Very mature and professional, we would say, obviously in a sarcastic way. That's it for today. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on that notification bell so you never miss out on any future content we'll produce for you guys. We're signing off now, but we'll be sure to catch you all in the next one.